In this video I'd just like to bring you up to date with the new big adjustment layers panel. After receiving numerous emails asking if I was going to update the panel and bring it into the current version of Photoshop, I've decided to bring it in as version 2. It's one of those panels that I created several years ago but it's one that's sort of slipped through the net and never really got updated. I wasn't sure whether many people was actually using the panel, but having looked at the analytics for the website and also looking at the number of emails I've been receiving, I thought it was about time that we actually brought this panel into the current version. The panel is slightly different to version 1 in the sense that we can now create an adjustment layer directly within the panel, as well as the traditional edit adjustment which opens that adjustment layer in that larger window. And that was the whole concept of creating this panel several years ago. I wanted a way to be able to open up the standard adjustment layer in that traditional larger window that we had around Photoshop CS6. So I'll just give you a quick demonstration what I mean by that larger window. So let's start by creating a curves adjustment layer and we can do that directly in the panel now. We've got the curves adjustment layer docked to the side but the larger panel that Photoshop CS6 gave us actually looks like this. When we press the edit adjustment we get this larger view appearing and this is a view that I like to use so I, you can make the adjustment and then when you commit the adjustment it will update the panel direct on the right hand side. I've added a selection of the most commonly used adjustment layers to the version 2. So for example this is the black and white adjustment layer and if we want to see this in that larger view we just press the edit adjustment and it brings this into this modal type form. We don't have to create the adjustment layers in the panel. If we go to the Photoshop way of creating the adjustment layers, and again I'll create a levels adjustment layer, we can still use the panel to open that in that larger view. So this is what the big adjustment layers does. It brings back that option that we had in Photoshop CS6 to be able to actually open up that adjustment layer in this bigger window or slightly bigger window. So this is now up to date as version 2. It's currently working with versions 24 of, Pho of Photoshop and it will work with any newer iterations of Photoshop as they come out in the future. So if you find it's a panel that may have some kind of a place in your workflow I will leave a link to it in the description below and it is now available on the website to use. So until next time, thank you for watching and bye for now.